Cybercrime is a persistent and ever-evolving problem for businesses and consumers alike. In 2021, the world experienced an influx in new cybercrime instances with ransomware problems alone rising by 62%. To help highlight how significant cybersecurity incidents can be, let's explore some of the most significant attacks and breaches from last year. But before we start, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with all the latest in the M360 tech and hit that bell for notifications. Let's get started. At number 10, we have the Florida water supply incident. In February, a hacker attempted to poison the water supply in Florida by adding sodium hydroxide in the treatment system, but was foiled by a worker who spotted the hack. No arrests were made, although it has left many officials concerned about the water system security. Now there's a story to quench your thirst. At number 9, we have the HSE COVID attack. Ireland's Health Service Executive, or HSE, faced a major ransomware attack in May by the criminal gang Wizard Spider, causing all of their IT systems to suddenly shut down. This was the biggest cybercrime known attack against a specific healthcare computer system to date. At number 8, we have the Excelion supply chain. A third of Excelion's FDA clients were victims of a worldwide hack into the Excelion file transfer program in March. Confidential data was taken from a host of large organizations, from Singtel to the University of Colorado, and even the Australian Securities and Investments Commission. At number 7, we have Acer Ransomware. Acer was hit by a Revil attack in March and were hit by one of the largest ransoms seen to date, $50 million. The ransomware group shared images of stolen files as proof, including documents which feature bank balances and financial spreadsheets. At number 6, we have Kiyiza Supply Chain. The ransomware attack on the Kiyiza Supply Chain stands out as one of the biggest from the summer, affecting more than 1,000 organizations. The attack targeted the VSA product used by managed service providers for remotely monitoring and administering IT services to customers. At number 5, we have CNA Insurance. CNA Insurance Company was hit by a sophisticated cybersecurity issue, disrupting the commercial group's network. Reports showed CNA systems had been infected with ransomware. The group ended up paying around $40 million in ransom for the release of its data and systems. At number 4 we have Microsoft Exchange Server. Four zero-day vulnerabilities in the Microsoft Exchange Server were discovered to be actively exploited by state-sponsored criminal groups. Microsoft was made aware of bugs in January. While fixes were issued, 30,000 organizations in the US were hacked including government bodies. At number 3 we have the JBS Cybercrime Ransom. The world's biggest meat producer, JBS, paid $11 million in ransom with Bitcoin after an attack shut down the company's operations throughout Canada, Australia and the US. The meat producer was forced to stop all of its operations for one day, which threatened significant supply chain repercussions. At number 2 we have Log4Shell. In December, a significant global remote code vulnerability was detected in the Apache Log4 logging system, used commonly by developers of server and web applications based on Java. Now, unfortunately, though developers worked to patch the vulnerabilities, mutations and additional issues began to rise. At number one, we have the Colonial Pipeline. May 2021 marked one of the most significant ransomware attacks in US history. A cyber attack on Colonial Pipeline forced the system to close all operations and freeze its IT systems. The problem was significant enough to lead to gas supply shortages. And that's all for this week's top 10. Thanks for joining us and for more great daily content, visit ian360tech.com.